Previously on Deus Ex, Adam finished the first boss fight of the game. The game responded by crashing and we lost 15 minutes of gameplay. The fan did not record the time he spent replaying those minutes. We pick up the story as Adam is ransacking the offices of his co-workers before meeting his boss for a debriefing. So anyway, yeah, we are still here. Uh, I think 25 there is the room where we crashed. And st I still have, I think, two more offices that I want to check. So let's get to it. Alright, I have the code for this one as well. Nice. Oh wow, there's a loud fucking dog outside. I hope you can't hear that. Or maybe you can. Maybe I hope you can. Might be a good experience for you. Hearing a grazed Finnish dog. Where will we be in 2050? Okay, whatever, I don't care. Anything else here? Ah, computer. Computer. Blah, 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 Pritchard. Oh, new access code. Dirty two. There's probably a sort of uh, progression that you could make with the access codes. If you wanted to just, you know, ransack offices without hacking anything. You could, I, I mean, I keep getting these occasionally. So I would probably, I could probably sort of surf around the offices in a particular order with that. But since I can hack stuff, who gives a shit about that? <laughs> Let's see, uh, I think we're gonna try from this direction. Ah, shit. Date credit stash located. Yes, I'm stealing so much Bitcoin while I'm doing this. <laughs> it's great. Access granted. Yep. Also, a funny thing I noticed uh, on one of the computers that I was hacking on my uh, the replay that you didn't see. What is everyone still doing here? What am I still doing here? <laughs> that's, yeah, that's kind of how I tend to be at school. Anyway, uh, I noticed that one of the computers I was hacking on my replay that I didn't record. Uh, I was I tried to hack a computer. What the fuck does Pikus have against us? What? Yeah, uh, one of the computers I failed to hack actually, I got caught. But I noticed there was a post-it note on the screen which had the password. So that's, uh, it's nice and realistic, I think. Also, uh, I have 5000 credits, so I think I'm actually, before I go see Mr. Serif, I think I'm gonna head out to town a little bit. I can, with 5,000 I can sort of pick up another praxis kit from the limb clinic, which is open 24-7 to satisfy all your augmentation needs, as we can see right here. I'm gonna pop, pop by the limb clinic and also I think I could should go check the merchant at the, uh, at the abandoned gas station and see if I can sell some of this shit off. I hope I can still remember how to navigate this place. Ah yeah, here it is. Here it is. It's, uh, even though it is fully closed on each side, I think the sort of city hub areas are quite impressive in the sense that they kind of almost seem like an open world at times. Although, of course, that means there's roads that are blocked by silly stuff. But still, it's it, it's impressive. There, that the Detroit one is qu quite large, actually. Well, uh, as you have seen, and then there's the Shanghai one, which we're gonna see later. That's even bigger, or at least that looks big, bigger. I'm not entirely sure. Okay, I can't sell anything here. Let's buy Praxis kit. Yes. Thank you. Uh, Always a pleasure, sir. Yeah, thank you. So, how many? Okay, I got two now, so that's... I'm uh, still gonna... I hold to my principle of with the practice points. I'm gonna save them until I know of a use for them. Also on the agenda, I need a fucking stun gun somewhere. 
the uh, first boss fight would have been much easier. I think I can actually sort of stun lock at least two of the bosses so that they can't really do anything. Anyway, this guy. What will it be? What will it be? Let's see, what can I sell? I have a combat rifle that I don't think I even used, really. Sell that, and I'm gonna sell the machine pistol. I'm gonna do with the 10mm and the drank rifle. Combat rifle ammo I can sell. Machine pistol ammo I can sell. Uh, not selling those, not selling my grenade. See you soon. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. So, anyway, yeah. Uh, question, why do I have two objective markers there? What's going on? Is that because... Ah, uh, yeah, I have two... Okay, yeah, I have secondary objective. Confront Sheriff. About the back door, okay, that makes sense. So, yeah, let's run back to... Back to Sheriff Industries. To I laugh at your pitiful stares. Haha. <laughs> Yay. Alright. Ba down. Ba down. Ba down. I jumped over that guy's head. <laughs> anyway. Uh, wait a minute. Where's the elevator? Do I need to. I might need to take the stairs here first. For some reason. Seri seriously, where's the elevator? Just here. You know, that's the... I'm doing something completely stupid now, aren't I? There it is. Yes, the elevator. Ele elevator. Click. I like how, the, how Detroit looks from the elevator here. And then uh, that is all taken away from me, because the game hates me. Oh! I have a feeling something's gonna happen. Let's see. Excuse me. Mr. Jensen, isn't it? Jensen, Sir, is it? you have that charity dinner? In a moment, Isaiah. I was hoping I might run into you, Mr. Jensen. Bill Taggart. Oh. The founder of the Humanity Front. I know who you are. Yes. Yes, I imagine you do. As David Sarah's top security man, I imagine you have quite the file on me. But I assure you, Mr. Jensen, I am devastated by recent events. Really? I do not support what you and your company are doing to mankind. I believe it's extremely dangerous. But abolishing human enhancement technologies will only be achieved through legal means. I'll keep that in mind. This is your first day back since the accident six months ago, isn't it? First day? Sir, we have to go. What happened to me was no accident. Ah, oh, my mistake. But it must have been stressful facing down a second incident so soon. I imagine it brought back all kinds of unpleasant memories. I appreciate your concern, Mr. Taggart. But it was nothing I couldn't handle. I'm a psychologist, Mr. Jensen. I know when a man is hiding behind words. Jesus Christ, the flesh may asshole. heal, but the mind is not always so resilient. You might want to keep that in mind. Now, if you'll be so kind as to excuse me. Not just yet. You got a lot of balls coming here. After your followers attacked our plant. What makes you think you'd be welcome? They were not my followers, Mr. Jensen. The Humanity Front is a peaceful organization. Radicals have no place in it. Right. right. Do you know why I formed this organization? Because I saw a technology about to run rampant. You yourself seem to be living proof of it. I'd be dead without these enhancements. I understand that. I also understand that on an individual level, these issues can be complicated. Why did I keep but this conversation going? we must look beyond our personal interests if we are to see mankind survive the next century. We'll survive, all right. With or without your condolences. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is this? You're Taggart's aide, aren't you? Dr. Isaiah Sandoval, isn't it? No need to play ignorant, Mr. Jensen. I am quite sure you have a file on me that's as thick as the one you have on Mr. Taggart. You're an outspoken activist in your own right, Dr. Sandoval. 
When you have seen the things that I have, you find you have no choice but to stand up and be counted. Frankly, I am surprised an ex-cop like yourself isn't more disturbed by the dangers of this technology. Augmentations help a lot of people, Doc. Handicapped, war vets. Yes, but at what cost? My own friend had his life ruined by these so-called enhancements of yours. A man much like you who had no choice but to become augmented. Yet, once he was, too much power can make you do terrible things, Mr. Jensen. I suggest you think long and hard on that. I'd like to hear more about your friend, Dr. Sandoval. What exactly did he do? Nothing. Was he injured in the Gulf? He went on a rampage in a shopping mall, if you must know, hoping to be gunned down by the police rather than face a lifetime battling augmentation addiction. He was addicted to augments? They don't talk about it in those corporate brochures of yours, do they? Neuropathy independency, rejection psychosis, any psychosis. number of physical and psychological ills have resulted from this technology, and yet, we rarely hear a word about them. I'm sure the literature is out there. No thanks to the throng of corporate lawyers attempting to stop it. Your friend, did he succeed? Did he suicide by cop? No. Bill Taggart talked him down. Jesus Christ. Right. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Breaking at City Morgue. Tampered with important evidence, all right. Oh, nice. Uh, anyway, uh, <laughs> so <laughs> apparently this is my first day on the job, which means that both the uh, attack beat by Mr. Sanders' guys and my uh, sort of my recent <laughs> trip to <laughs> the FEMA facility have been during the same day. And also, since it's been dark outside all the time, it can't have been more than like, say, eight hours. So yeah, maybe this game is operating in real time. <laughs> I don't know. Weird. And also, quite a fucking day. And it's not over yet. Let's talk to this guy. Boss, we need to talk. Is something wrong? I'm not sure. Did you set up a private access route to bypass the company firewall right before you hired me? Like <laughs> what? Pritchard said someone's been using it to access our system since before the first attack. The security measures he and I set in place never stopped them because we didn't even know the loophole existed. Oh, I see. Frank's fixed that, though, right? He has now. But he's wondering why you never mentioned it. Frank's paranoid, Adam. You know that. Can a busy man forget things once in a while? You streamed an awful lot of data through that portal, boss. Right before you brought me on board. Preacher may be paranoid, but I gotta admit, I'm wondering what was in it too. Yeah, as an ex-cop, I guess you would. But the important thing is, you found the hole and plugged it. We're secure now. And the information you uncovered in that FEMA facility may actually help us track these guys. So let's just stay focused on what's important. Also, I didn't fucking save my game before I talked to him. I want to, believe me. I want to catch these guys as badly as you do. But that breach is responsible for every security crisis we've had, including today's. If you want me to stop these guys, I need to know what kind of data they've had access to. You're right, you're right. I'm sorry if I seem evasive. But there's something you're not getting here, Adam. Business is war. With no clear battleground and no rules to keep our enemies honest. In this company, I'm the commander-in-chief. And I have to be ready for anything, and I will do anything to ensure that I am. Now, I hired you because I needed a general I could trust. One who knows how to obey orders. Uh, <laughs> 
Yes, well, don't get me wrong, way. boss. I'm not questioning your leadership. I'm just concerned that the data you streamed might have been compromised, accessed by the hacker who attacked us. If so, how do you suggest I handle it? Good question. I guess we should consider every possibility. Look, I'm not going to share every single detail of this data with you. As CEO of this company, there are things I can't release, even to you, Frank, or Athena. I consider us all a team here but we each have our own roles to fill. I decide who gets trusted with what, and in this case, you're just gonna have to do your job without knowing all the facts. Megan said you could roll with the punches. Prove she was right. Pheromones. Boss, I really don't understand why you're giving me the runaround. When you hired me, I said I'd give you the best I could, but I can't protect us if you keep hamstringing my every move. If you won't level with me and tell me what it is you're hiding, then I'm out of here. I quit. Adam, 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 wait. You can't leave us. We need you. All right, I think we now more won than ever. This one. All right. Look. The truth is I set up a confidential data channel for a private investigator, someone who can run covert background checks on people, potential new recruits like you. You what? I had to, Adam. You were a liability, remember? You'd just been fired from SWAT. Now, Megan believed in you, but I had to be sure. Look. I don't want this to come between us. I'll send the files to your computer. You can see for yourself what he dug up. But Adam, you'd better be sure. Why? What do you mean? I mean, sometimes the past should stay in the past. Once you see that data, you can't unring the bell. When you're ready, come back and talk to me. We need to discuss our next move. Oh. Okay. And I got another praxis point for that. Which is nice. Oh, and I also. Oh, for fuck's sake. The question is do I need to go down and read my email at this point? So. Oh, okay, let's. Let's do that. Let's go back down for a while. They left the fucking toilet door open. Assholes. Anyway, uh, yeah. It's kind of dumb. We, I couldn't do the sort of debriefing of the super soldier situation at the same time. But anyway, let's go. Also, it <laughs> strikes me that there's a there's a thing that. Adam should have, which is a fucking tablet. You could have read your email up there. Which co is this computer? Yes, it is. Okay. A friend at the Genevieve Labs run the test of the records like you asked. Brent Radford. Paternity test. Does your subject know that neither of his parents are his birth parents? That surprised me. Mother was sterile. That carries no common phenotypes. Marty Jensen, Arthur Jensen, Adam Jensen. 93. Probability of parentage zero. Wow. Also, hey, Adam Jensen almost shares my birthday. I'm born, I was born... Wait a minute, no it doesn't. That's the American wait. Ah, fuck it. I thought that was September, but I think it's actually March night. Finally backtraced some of Marty and Arthur Jensen's past through their medical files. Arthur was a bit of connections through his old desert storm buddies. Records pulled, couldn't hide Marty's records for a period of eight years. Arthur relied on the insurance policy of White Helix Labs. She was an antidepressant since 14 and needed regular prescriptions. One minute Adam doesn't exist, and the next Jensen have to start bouncing a healthy five year old. That's when they pull their vanishing act. Try the tough thing, kids. 
Oh. Marty was deemed unfit as a ferret. Damn. Psych evaluation following the SWAT incident. Problems with authority figures, disregard for the chain of command, anger management issues, and potential PTSD. The evaluation reads like fiction. Beast of Superior. Most of the rank and file is respected and liked Jensen. That was a real straight suitor. Okay. Well, that's backstory. Athena tells me you spoke to oh. Sarath. Did he no. happen to tell you why he made us look like idiots? I'm handling it. You can imagine how relieved I am to hear that. I'll tell you what. While you follow any lead Sarath spoon feeds you, I'm going to do what I should have done in the first place and backtrace that signal. That's your pride talking. Still, get back to me if you find something. You meant when? Pretty sure I didn't. Okay. And back up we go. So... Did Adam take the blame for... Instead of Haas for that shooting that kid or something? Is that what I'm supposed to read here? I don't know. Well, it doesn't matter really. Let's keep going. Here, this is for you. It's a corporate passport encoded with your biometrics. I've set up a false flag routing which should get you to Henshaw Island without any problems. You're sending me to China? What about FEMA? FEMA's got nothing to do with this, trust me. We'll have better luck in China. How can you say that? I saw the bastard who killed Megan pulling his men out of that facility. I left one of those men dead in its underground storage bay. I know that, Adam. Frank was monitoring the whole thing. So I also know that before he died, that man gave you an address in China. I want you to check it out. That doesn't make any sense. Look, Adam. There's a reason this company's under attack. You think it has to do with the typhoon or with some other top secret military project that I haven't told you about? The thought had crossed my mind. Yeah, well, it doesn't. The work Megan's team was doing before they were killed, it was redefining what it means to be human. This company, Seraph Industries, was about to lead mankind to its next stage in human development. Self-controlled evolution. Can't you see how scary yeah, that can be to some people? Works. Sure. I also see how lucrative it can be for some others. It's never been about money for me, Adam. But you're right. There are people out there who don't exactly feel the same. Like who? I'm hoping you'll be able to find that answer for us in China. So get going. Farida's prepping the chopper. Yeah, all right. So, wait, yeah, there's... The chopper is ready. I mean, if we had business here, we could go and take care of it, but I don't think we really need to right now. I can tell you this is not the last we'll see of the beautiful Detroit. But the rest would be spoilers. Oh, yeah, that's the square, actually, there, the, in the front. So, yeah, now I'm getting the... Uh, the layout of this place, you can see. Or maybe I'm not. No, 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 I'm not, actually. <laughs> that can't be what I saw. I don't know. It's confusing. I should fucking close my door. <laughs> anyway. Let's go down here, jump. First of all, let's okay, let's just see if there was something down here. No. I I know I had a I, I got a code for something near the helipad. A storage locker or something like that. I'm gonna see if I can find it before I go. Ding 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 ding. Nothing here, right? Might be there actually is nothing here. Okay. No 
Okay, whatever. I can't see anything interesting. Hey, Jensen. The boss said you were on your way. You're gonna love Hangsha. You've been there? Used to live there. I spent three, maybe four years working in the upper city. And most of my nights having fun in the lower one. You ready to go? I thought I was. How long is oh, this gonna take, something about You mean the flight or the fun afterward? Don't worry. We'll be there before you know it. Climb in. Yeah, this is uh, actually a cut off point. I think there was a warning about uh, about if you had uh, side quests to go in Detroit. But you couldn't complete them anymore. Boy, that helicopter disappearing looked bad. Okay, let's see what's happening now. Jensen, you might want to get ready. The jewel of the Yangtze approaches. Son of a bitch. I'm supposed to find answers in that. Hey, twice the scum and half the space. Hang on, we're going in. The address you got off that Merc, Hengsha Court Gardens. It's a bit of a walk from here in the Yuzhou district, but I figured it might be best not to drop you too close. In case Barrett only gave up the address, knowing I'd walk into another trap. It's the kind of thing I'd do to an enemy. You want my advice? Just find out who lives there and get out. So yeah, this is uh, an interesting place. It's uh, sort of a multi-level city here. So let's do the routine thing here, first of all. Not since last week. I'm starting to get worried. She missed Hello, sir. We are on break. But if you would like to talk to one of the girls on duty... Newspaper. Tim announces new cast team news. Don't care. I'm starting to get worried. She missed three days of work Okay. okay. Hengsha Court Garden, Alice Garden, Porch Limb Clinic, Shuttle Station. Okay, whatever. Okay, let's see. I have three praxis points. I think most of the upgrades only cost two points, so I basically have one extra. Uh, I could get a third energy cell, which would be good. Would be really good, actually. Considering I have the invisibility thing. I could get... well, I can't get Typhoon with the extra points yet. What's here? Punch through wall, carrying ca carrying capacity would actually be co oh, pretty good as well. Aim stabilizer. Uh, dermal armor. Okay, that's just armor. Yeah. Oh, I could up I could upgrade that to five seconds. Landing system, reflex booster. I don't know what to get. Shit. I have to meditate on this, I think. Meanwhile, let's move on somewhere. Hello. Don't stay here, Lawai. This city is very dangerous. Especially lower. Too many groups fighting. Don't give a shit. <laughs> you look tired. Hey, Fuck you. Do you know how to get to the the Hong Hong Kua Hong Kong Hua Hong Kua Hotel? Ah, I see. Someone's looking for some action, huh? <laughs> how are you getting this trip? Just walk over there and come to the city. What's up? I can help you. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, I can just go in the back room and steal money. Have a good evening, sir. Enjoy the pleasures of Hengsha. You know, there's an amazing view of the cityscape on the rooftop that's just underneath the Pangu. If you're nice enough, maybe I'll take you there. You know, I'm afraid of heights, and I'm not really sure how. So I yeah, this is a. Uh, I'm not sure if it's actually bigger than Detroit, but it's certainly sort of. Uh, there's more twists and turns to this place here. Okay, let's see. Let's stop fucking around here. Let's see what we're gonna do. Investigate the penthouse apartment. Okay. So I should be going here. Yes. Yeah, maybe. Hey. What are you looking for, Lovely? Guns? Hacking equipment? What makes you think I'm looking for that kind of stuff? Hey, I don't want to step on your toes. Just Merchant at the Hanghua Hotel. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, different district. Yeah, great. So quiet. Wonder if I have a map of this place. Because, well, yeah. Kuai Khan district. Yeah, there's different districts here. I can't. I was just looking to see that hotel. Maybe there's a. I think a bringing in Bell Tower to police the city is a great thing for Shanghai. For sure, some of those corrupt officials. Oh, town. great! Yeah, let's bring in, go, bring in sort of uh, private security. Yeah, that you know, seems great. I need to get something in my apartment. I don't care. Sorry, pal. No one's allowed in right now. I need to get something huh. in my apartment. I don't care what kind of operation is going on. Okay, let's do something stupid, shall we? Now let me in immediately. Can't oblige you, ma'am. Now move along, please. Seriously? Bell Tower is conducting an investigation in this building, sir. No admittance. Seriously? Really? Malik, you might have been right about that trap. Hengsha Court Garden is under lockdown what the hell is that? by Bell Tower Associates. Bell Tower? They're the police in Lower Hengsha, Jensen. They're under contract with the Chinese government. <laughs> okay, so that's how far we could actually go. I need to get something in my apartment. I don't care what kind of operation is going on. Now, So... Pinky, are you pondering what I'm pondering? Let's see now. Okay, here. Okay, next step. I can jump here, I can jump here, I can jump here, I can jump here, I think. Yes, thank you. Okay. Okay, let's see what's this. Time to hack some shit up. Okay, I think we need to take this route. Shit. Access granted. 
Thank you. Okay. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna just check what's in this side. It's another ladder. I wonder where that goes. Well, I can't. I have, I have a job to do, so. Let's see. Alright. Okay, let's be let's be neat and let's close the vent covers, at least. Seriously, I can't close that. Okay, whatever. So, elevator shaft, nice. We need to go on this side. Yes, all right. Up, up higher. Oh, the elevator is actually moving. Okay, now what? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, there's something up in the penthouse, I think. Wonder how far that fell. <laughs> Probably not a good idea in real life. In a real life situation, if you are uh, cybernetically modified or uh, super police, then you shouldn't do that when you're infiltrating a building. Okay. Shit's about to get interesting, I think. So, of course, we save the game first. So this fucking place, this I see five people in here in this on this floor, I think. And I don't know how they're gonna move here. Moving vending machines is an essen essential spy skill. Okay, I know I'm not going supposed to go this way, but I'm gonna just see see what I can see from here first. Nah, let's not go let's not go there unless we have to. Okay, so this way, yes. Is that? Oh shit. Why? What the fuck is going on in here? That's not very nice. Holy shit. Okay. Yeah, that's a that's a fucking burning hole in the wall. That's interesting. Wonder how many more guards there are. Oh, hello. There's a dude. And there's a third dude. That's a lot of dudes. Okay. Huh. So that's three dudes in this room. And I need to figure out how to get past them. Nice. Turn back. 
Turn back. Turn back, motherfucker. Thank you. remember how long it's been so let's just make a new save here and then will I die if I walk through that oh shit yeah. huh so that worked nice software here nice Oh, so yeah, okay, I get it. Yeah, somebody broke into the computer room here. <laughs> because obviously, oh, for fuck's sake. Is that guy gonna see me? Anyway, well, let's finish this. Oh, hello. Huh, weird. Well, if I have nukes, I'm gonna use them, I think. Let's hope I'm lucky here and they don't start to trace. Thank you. So that means I can probably. No, I don't have any more nukes. Okay, great. Oh, for fuck's sake. Here and here. Access granted. Thank you. Hive master, you there? Pick up, pick up, pick up, please. Drop over, still good. Depends what you do, Ari. Lunch on tap PC never is so orange. <laughs> I like the sort of uh, <laughs> instant message language here. What the fuck you do, Windmill? Never seen Dragon Lady this field. By the way, hung on. Beat is hung your way. Save this option just you get out now. The high will be celebrating 50 years in Lower Hengsha. The high is a club, I think. Get word to Pritchard Malik. The hacker who's been attacking us goes by the handle Windmill. Real name's Ari Van Bruggen. Bell Tower's been brought in to arrest him. Arrest? Or get rid of? Either way, he found out someone was gunning for him and took off. We need to find him. There's a nightclub near where I dropped you called The Hive. It's notorious in black market circles. If this Dutchman is running, his first stop will be there. I'll have a chat with the owner. Okay. Now I just need to get the fuck out of here without being seen. Right. Okay, thank you. There's an elevator, which is most assuredly not a good option. <laughs> Let's go here, close the vent cover, thank you. Get back to the elevator shaft. Apparently I can't close those from the outside for some reason. Going down. And going down. Back in here. 
Jensen, figured you might want a heads up before you stroll into the hive. The owner's name is Tong Si Hung, Tong being his last name. Rumor is, he's tied to the triads. China's organized crime lords. How wonderful. Anyone else want a piece of this pie? Okay, time to check out where this ladder leads. Is this just another alter alternate way to the roof? Or what? It might be. It most certainly could be. Something like that. Well, there doesn't seem to be anywhere to go here, so I imagine that's just... Just there. Just because. Just. Okay, okay. So first of all, no. There were guards there, I can assume they still are. I'm just gonna go down. And go down and go down and go down. And down. And down. The fuck is that? Okay. Anyway, so we know we know what to do now. We need to go to the night club. That's well, the afraid, way we climbed. Good. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. First of all, I want to see what's behind this <laughs> closed door because there's a <laughs> there's something to hack here. That, oh oh that's interesting. Okay. Well whatever. Okay. Shit. Well, we have enough time. Access granted. Yay, script kitty. So let's see what's in here. Haha. <laughs> it's a uh, place. Uh -huh. Okay. There's a shop here that's behind a closed gate. Which is interesting. What do you think of Lower City? Mostly workers from Taiyang Medical live here. Low renting housing, especially at the Alice Garden Park. So yeah, that's basically a great business decision. Hey, American, go Yankees! <laughs> you want good time? Go to the hive. You want better time? Find a Hong Kong. Beautiful as women in Hang Sa. Huh. That's a... Bangea. Bangea. I actually think that's not a place we should go right now. I remember there's some either plot or side plot stuff there. Okay, I should go to Hang Hua. Hang Hua Hotel, which apparently is that way. What the hell? Really? Really? There was some mention of some guy selling guns there. Okay, let's see. So probably through here. Quagan, Quagan District. Yes, okay. This is actually one of those, uh, this sort of, this whole Hong Kong hub is one of those places where it's kind of easy to get lost. Even though there are uh, these things. No, that's not helpful. Hang Hua Hotel, where is it? My buddy Les never pays to get into the hive. Does he know one of the bouncers? No. That son of a bitch knows the way what? into the back alley. Share with the rest of them? I don't think so. Asshole. Shit. Get it, man. It's that way? Out here. Finish that six and go back. Maybe it's here. Let's see. Just that's it. Bell tower. And probably something dirty. Hey. Ooh. Manhole cover. Interesting. Interesting. What the fuck is that? Okay. Anyway, let's see. Hang Hua Hotel. Okay, so it's, it's it's like this place. Oh, hello. Keep to the crowded areas of Lower City if possible, sir. Have a good evening, sir. Okay, let's see. Will they kill me if I try to go past them? Enjoy the pleasures of Hang Sha. Okay, there's no way to go there. So I'm at the hotel-ish. So who's the guy selling weapons? Oh, I don't care. Okay, 
Go check the back room. <laughs> Steal some money. Thank you. Oh, hello. What's this? Oh, shit. Will we have enough time? Come on. Access yes, we got it. So much in here. Money. Okay, great. Nothing. Doing nothing illegal here. Pay no attention to me. Wait, is this the hotel entrance? Oh, it's... yeah, of course. I was confused by the arrows going <laughs> up, going in that direction instead of this one, but yeah. I get so lost down here. Every time I come yeah, down I don't give a shit. City. I mean, the streets are well marked and all... Okay, Hanghua Hotel. So, is there somebody selling guns here, somewhere? Sorry, but for the service you want, you damn well better believe I'm getting my full amount of credits. Sweet pea. I can hardly make my uh, rent. Join the club, sweet pea. I'm gonna save my game before I go inside that place again. That might not be kosher. Or maybe it is. I don't know. Let's see. Nothing here. Hello. Locker. Nothing here. Ebook. Hearts of Steel, this looks like fiction. When he looked at her, the hurt in his eyes got like blades. Probably like, you know, oak porn or something like that. Let's see. Hack, 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 hack. Whoa. Okay, let's see. So, yeah, the smaller numbers will be easier to hack. Actually, well, there's a two, but then there's a four in there, so I think I'm gonna go this way instead. Yes, all right, the first one didn't activate the trace, that's good. So now they have two trees, but then the rest are ones, unless something changes them. And here we go. But it's a 30 second trace, so yeah, that's not gonna be a problem, I don't think. Grand. Yeah, not even close. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and deactivate the camera. Thank you very much. Also, I'm gonna see what this what's in here. Come on, come on. Access granted. Ammo and money and some shoes. I'm gonna leave the shoes here. Okay, apparently no one gives a shit, even though I rifle through their office. It's good to I know. I wouldn't go upstairs if I were you. Why not? Wait, don't tell me. Me and Edgar going at it again? Yep. And you know what that means. Yeah. Edgar in a bad mood. Shame too. Okay, whatever. Sweet Don't care. I'm always amazed by what May gets away with. Well, she's earned the right to talk back from time to time. Up, 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 up. When a party, I can go all night. Sorry, mister. I'm only dancing tonight. You want more? You can't do it, Shaker. The augmented girls But once in a while, I like to try that. come to for a good time? Some guys say they can't tell you. You guys are boring. Okay, no action here. Or at least not the guide I'm looking for. Oh, no. Don't tell me I left my purse in there with May. Hey, mister, you think you could go in there and pretend to be a customer? It might break up the fight. Huh. Ever since Ning went missing. 
Okay, let's see what the fight is about. May has been on the warpath. I told you, I am not getting augments. Not for, for this! Our customers would pay much for the services of an augmented girl. You can make a lot of money. Then tell customers to get themselves augmented <laughs> and they can go <laughs> fuck themselves! Nice. I'm sure, some already may. You have a customer. Get to work. My apologies, sir. I was not aware May had a client waiting. Okay. Go away now. Or don't. Really? You're not gonna... Please, enjoy your evening. Yeah, please, fuck off. You're not a customer, are you? What makes you say that? The way you move. Your attitude. And what's my attitude? Please. A soldier. Someone on business. So why are you here? I heard your argument. What was that all about? They want me to get augmentations for the customer's pleasure. It's Bionic sick. vagina. I quit before I ever let them touch me. Sounded like they don't consider it an option. They don't. I am lucky, I guess. I've been here the longest. It has advantages. But the new girls, they're not so lucky. What do you mean? They are forced to get augments. It's very bad. One of the girls who work here, Ning, she has been gone for days. I fear they took her and will force her to get augmented. You seem... you seem like a good man. I am desperate. Please, can you help? I can pay you. You keep referring to them. Who are they? The Honghua Hotel used to be independent. In the past, we had to deal with local police for protection. And because we ran a clean and safe business, they looked the other way. But then, things changed. What happened? Bell Tower became the police in Lower oh, Hansa, shit. and they not care to help us. So, a drug lord came in with all his men and took control. Things has never been the same. And we cannot do anything about it. Why do you think Ning has been kidnapped? Before, we could always refuse augmentations. Yeah, 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 is yeah. Ning one of the pure brutes? Yes. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> that stupid question is because they want, want to force her to get a bionic vagina. What do you need me to do? I heard the girls are drugged and taken to a place somewhere in Dagong district. There, they're held until the doctor comes. I wish you to find this place, to find where they're holding Ning. I hope it's not too late. You said you can pay. How much are we talking here? If you free Ning, I will pay good. A thousand credit. More, if you're willing to help again. Okay, I'll help your friend. Thank Side you. quest. I knew I was right about you. Side Mr. quest. Jensen. Mr. Jensen, I fear this little time. You must find Ning before they leash her with augments. Leash her? Yes, they call it that. They leash their girls with augments oh, to keep them nice. under control by supplying neuropazine. I do not know where they keep Ning, just that it is somewhere in Dagong district. A specific location would help. I tell you, I do not have one. But there is a bouncer here, Chuan Li. He works with these people. He will know where Ning is. He goes to the roof to smoke often. Look for him there. You might be able to convince him to reveal the place. Anything else you can give me? Yes. The men holding Ning. They most likely work with local triad gang here, the harvesters. If you look for some of them around, maybe you find Ning better. Got it. All right, we have a side quest. So, let's see, go to quests, gonna inactivate the main quest and we're gonna go for here, so, let's see, speak to Chuan Li on the roof, okay, let's go do that, should be able to convince him, where is he, wait, it's the helipad, isn't it, it is actually, yeah. Okay, let's save the game, so just in case we fuck this up. 
All right. Shove off before I shove you off. I'm here to see you. Uh huh. What about? Ning. Open the phone book. Plenty of them in there. Your friends are holding her. I can make it worth your while if you tell me where. Worth my while? Yeah, maybe. Let's see some credits first, the tough guy, and then maybe I'll tell you where to find her. Pheromones. I gotta make sure she's okay first. She'll be a lot more valuable to me and you if she's alive and in one piece, if you know what I mean. I get it. Smart businessman you are. Okay, okay. I'll tell you. They're holding her on a small side street just off the open gutter in the Daigong district. But listen, I didn't say anything, right? Oh, well, that was easy. And if that guy thinks I'm actually gonna pay him, then he's an idiot. Okay, let's see. Can we go through here? I think we can. See, so, uh, this sort of... <laughs> you'll notice that we came to the roof of the building, but now we're suddenly it looks like we're on the street. Just, uh, just the design of the uh, Hong Kong district here. Actually, it's kind of weird like this. You can see we are actually kind of high up here. Even though it occasionally looks like just a street. Also, another thing I just... Okay, I'm... <laughs> I wonder, at some point we're gonna have to buy the landing system. Actually, let's buy that one. Because, <laughs> because just for the hell of it. Because once we have that, we can actually go back up here, and what we can do is we can do this. <laughs> yeah, because that's awesome. <laughs> also, it helps. Uh, we don't have to sort of. I don't have to stress about being up high so much. And actually, I can if I hold a button down, I can actually uh, stun people as I come down. Although I think I'm. Oh wow! Oh, I, I remember this place actually. There's a. We actually are quite close already. I know not. Let's see why. Drunk rifle. Thank you. No, put it away. No, not that button. You're in the wrong part of town, Lao Lai. Go back. Don't hide. Ah. All right, we are quite close. Do we have anything we can... That uh, was a secondary. <laughs> Thank you. He's gone! Better keep my eyes open. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> we could have maybe gone to an upper level instead. Actually, we probably still can, come to think of it. If we go here... It's the fucking sewer. Somewhere here there's a... Oh, or we could go even lower. Huh, weird. Somewhere in here there's a... I mean, I know we're going up there, up thereabouts. Maybe. Uh, somewhere in here there's a stair set of stairs, I think. Get up, up one level. Oh yeah, here. Great. So we can get up. Wait a minute. Hold on, hold up. Okay, yeah, he has another set of stairs. We need to go up one more level. I feel like the only place to work around here is TYM. I don't feel like being a part of the machine. Yeah, you I don't want to work for that weirdo Hugh Darrow in Panchea. Okay, let's see. Alright, so yeah, that's where we're going. Uh, hmm. 
Eliminate Ning's guards. You know, I need to kill them? Well, that's weird. Well, I don't... Shit. I don't have the uh, range here. And I'm not sure if I can get clo getting much closer. Damn. Huh, maybe this wasn't such a great idea. There's no way to hit him with this gun. Let's see. I have the invisibility thing that I can use. Get up here. <laughs> okay. So well, <laughs> that <laughs> accomplished much. Now we're back here. Anyway. Seriously, we still can't hit him. That can't be right. Is that guy gonna come all the way over here? Did not work out very well. Last save. Okay, so I'm back here now. I could just start shooting, I guess. That's one possibility. have enough of these actually have one of those well that guy is coming so leave me okay Oh shit. I could not <laughs> knock the third one out. Also. Laser sight, laser sight. Okay. Seriously? Cops, great. Okay, that won't work. That really won't work. <sighs> Shit. I don't know how well that works. What is it's actually a yeah, it's a frag grenade. Although that might kill the civilian as well. Let's go down here. There was a manhole cover here. Let's see where this takes us. It's possible this might be an alternate route towards those guys. Once you've seen one sewer, you have seen them all. Yeah, at least this goes in the right direction. Huh. All right. Huh. Looks like someone lives here. And has left left their home without any shoes. What? Really? Can't go in there? Huh. Weird. I can't. I can't get. Apparently, I can't get anywhere through here. That's weird. Is this re really? 
There's there's nowhere to go. Damn. Shit. Well, this was a waste of time, obviously. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. This was where we came from, I think. Maybe. Or was it? Am I completely lost already? No, okay, this was not where we came from. Now I'm on the other side of this, and I, that still doesn't help me. <laughs> okay, where's the fucking manhole cover? <laughs> Adam Jensen, getting lost in a sewer. I would hate to have to call Richard to help me. No, here it is. Okay. Back up. Yes, thank you. So, three dudes. Okay. Actually, no, not that one. Actually, I have that. If you saw, I pressed X there. There's, uh, I have an augment in the trunk rifle. No, not an augment, actually. Uh, let's see. Darts follow an arc, whatever. I have a lead fire targeting suite. Scope leading software to predict the target's movements. Okay. So, yeah, I should probably do that. Okay, I'm gonna save the game here again. I'm gonna see if I can, from this distance, if I can actually take them all out with drunk darts. Activate that thing. Okay, wait for it. This is not the place for you. Okay. Oh wow. That was actually a really good place to kill him. I think he's actually out of sight there. Search him. Okay, he's got nothing. Well then. Okay, so if I... I could go invisible. Pop up and kill that guy. Or, well, not kill him. Trank him. No, you're a Okay. And now what we do is we take this one, go usable again, okay, alright, yeah, I, for <laughs> I was trying to take him out, but I forgot that the takeout thing also takes energy, which I already spent. With the invisibility. Let's just take their weapons here and then search the guys. No, he's got nothing. Oh, hello. What's this? Code for the girl's holding pen 5377. Delete this after you change the fucking code. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Put the gun away. So, yeah, they're here. Who are you? Your friend May sent me. She said you were in trouble. Are you hurt? May? Thank God. And no. No, I'm fine. They didn't touch me. Not yet, anyway. If you hadn't come, though, how did you find me? I asked around. I can be persuasive. I... I have to get out of here. You sure you're okay? Can you leave here on your own? Yes. I... thank you. 
Whoever you are, thank you so much. I need to go. I need to get out of this city. I need to get away from that monster, Chan. Tell me, tell her. Thank you for everything. I owe her, I owe you both my life. Okay, return to mail. Let's see, is there anything here that I need? I could steal. Probably not. I don't have a feeling. I have a feeling they probably don't let the prisoners have any sort of military equipment or something like anything that I can use. Oh well. That was, I would say, a success. We, uh, and we did get through that without killing anyone, which is nice. Always nice. Uh, I, what I really, really would like to hi find now is somebody who can sell me weapons and buy weapons. How can I help you? Probably you probably can't, but you know because <laughs> because as you noticed, I took their guns as well, so now I'm carrying extra shit. Hello. And I would like to offload. Can't you see we're having a private conversation here? Fuck you too. Hey, American. Go Yankees. No way. Talk to that guy already. Enjoy your stay in Hangshaw, sir. Just not too much. Not too much. Well, fuck you too. Seriously, I don't know what I don't know who I'm looking for. You're looking for some action, Lawai. Stick no, to I'm looking quiet for action. I'm Lots looking for a fucking gun shop. Thank you. Oh, here's actually. I think this is the Hive Club here, yeah, where we are supposed yes. to go for our main Many mission. Many distance people from Upper Hangsha go there. Where are you traveling? Well, we will go, but probably not during this video. See if I can if I can't find it. I'm just gonna go back to the hotel, I think. And uh, what are you looking at? Your ugly face, you asshole. <laughs> Probably just gonna head back to the hotel. Hello. And talk to that chick again. Let's see. I think I need to go to Yocho district, maybe, or maybe not, the, the marker is in a different place. Okay, let's see, where the fuck am I? Here? Maybe. Yeah. Here? This place is confusing. Um, yeah, he has the hotel. I get so lost down here. Every time I come down from the upper city. I mean, the streets are well marked and all, but... Okay, serious. There was supposed to be someone oh, selling, Kai, selling guns around the hotel here. Just gonna check nearby here. Another expat. Welcome to the yeah, fuck you. Okay, I can't go in there, I don't think. Come on, where are you? Friendly neighborhood gun salesman. Here, this guy. Okay, I think we're going to have to go back to the hotel. I look down on you because you're lying on the fucking floor, asshole. You're looking for some action, Lawai. Stick to quiet gun district. Shit. Why won't anyone sell me guns? Okay, now we're back at the club already. Yeah, this uh, it looks this place looks big, but it's not actually that big. The club was there, and then we go around the corner, and the hotel is here. Here, yes. No, that's where we came from. Okay, I, can, I have no idea where I can buy guns here. That's, that sucks. 
Let's just go finish this quest. At least. My apologies, sir. Yeah, 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 Edgar, fuck you. Edgar Lee, I sense you're a bit of a prick. Stairs, 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 stairs. No, not here. Wrong floor. Up, 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 up here. Ning, did you find her? I did. She's safe, but running. I think she plans on leaving the city. She always is a smart girl. I'm glad. I will contact her to make sure she is safe. As promised, here's your payment. If you want more, I have another task. Something suitable for a man of your many talents. Are you interested? My interest would depend on the task. By now, I'm sure you heard of Diamond Chan. He is evil man who feeds off the pain and misery of this city. If we are to stay in peace here, he must be taken care of. You want me to kill Chan? Yes, but you must make it look like an accident or suicide. What kind of payment is involved? Double what I give you for rescuing Ning. If you make certain we are rid of Chan for good. Okay. There has to be another way to remove Chan from the picture without resorting to murder. There is. I have access to certain stimulants. If Chen was caught with them, he would no longer be a problem. Meaning I could plant drugs on him? Not on him. Some way in his apartment will be enough. He may be dead though. So knock him out, leave the drug, and come back here to me. I have a friend. He works with the police. I'll contact him and he'll make sure Chen is arrested. I'll do it. Good. I'll give you the address of Diamond Chen's apartment. It is on one of the nearby rooftops. Lower hand size. Oh, we changed the plan place. now. I see. Simply knock Chen out, then drop his body into the alley below. Gravity will do the rest. But if you wish only to get Chen arrested, take these drugs. Okay. Plant them somewhere in his apartment after you've knocked him out. When you are done, return to me and I will contact my friend in the police. He will do the rest. Anything else I should know? Chen should be alone. I didn't want a package of he drugs. He is too proud to have bodyguards around. But be careful. Even alone, Chen is dangerous. Got it. Mr. Jensen, remember not to cause any wounds on Diamond Chen that make it look like murder. Any suspicion will bring us more trouble from his friends. So no tranquilizers or peps, which means strictly hand-to-hand -hand submission Shouldn't be a problem. That is good, yes. Good luck, Mr. Jensen. I will wait here. <sighs> yes, I would like one drugs, please. Uh, hey yo. <laughs> okay, let's see. Inventory and... Uh, quest items. Corporate passport, package one drugs. Okay. Anyway, yeah. This is a good time, I think, to save the game. Next time! The continuing adventures of Adam Jensen in the Hive Club and various other interesting locations. This is the fan, signing off.